my god, that's smoking a lot. Okay. Where am I gonna put this to where it's even in frame? I can move, I can move the mic. But once we start launching, what we're gonna launch, it's gonna, the video is gonna be literally like right here. Whatever. Okay, whatever. All right, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're gonna be watching The Boys. The Boys, season two, episode five. In the last episode, Butcher found Becca. But it ended very damn quickly because <sighs> Becca kind of realized pretty quickly that, like, okay, no, it was nice to see them reunite, but she realized pretty quick Butcher doesn't give a fuck about Ryan because he's a soup and that Vault will just be after them their entire lives. So they have to run. They have to literally keep running. They have to literally ditch Ryan. And Becca doesn't want to ditch Ryan because that's her fucking son. So respect to Becca. It was a hard decision. It wasn't easy for her, but she had to do it. She cares too much about her son. And also, she did make a very strong point saying, well, what if I leave Ryan? Then we got two assholes in the world because he'll be, he'll grow up to be just like Homelander because that's what happened to Homelander. So, and then we also found out Stormfront is actually Liberty from 1970s, right? Which, and then uh, Starlight made up a really good point saying like, wait, do they age at all? Like, you know, she was like, let's say 20 in her 20s and 1970s, right? Well, dude, she'd have to be like 60 now. I don't know if that math's right. That just, okay, whatever. But she would she would be a lot older now, right? So, okay, so do, do the superheroes age or not? You know, or do they just stay whatever age, or like, do they just age super damn slowly? You know, like, Homelander, he looks older. It's because the actor is a little older, probably. But like, Homelander, if I'd guess, is probably like 38, 40 you know like does he actually physically age or does it take a while for them to age or is he just gonna stay like that forever you know i let me know please but anyways i'm gonna stop wasting time we're just gonna hop right into this episode if you want uh, if you if you would like to watch the full length reaction that'll be available on patreon as well early access to the next two episodes of the boys that i do will also be on patreon so let's get started Ruby! this looks like a movie and they're supposed to be doing this isn't real they pitched the movie in the last episode or the episode before that broken into that dhs mainframe yeah it's a movie like you i'm gay and cut yeah i knew it was a movie i knew it was a movie that was probably in the movie because homelander said that on live tv in the last episode too you're right really sings huh Joss Rewite? Like Joss Whedon? There you do. You're in love. Dude, fuck off, dude. Not ever. <sighs> I mean, that would be cruel. No, what he's doing is cruel. It's like rubbing in her fucking face. Like she wanted to keep it a secret, but he's like making her. He's just making it louder, basically. <laughs> Oh my god. He just pulled up into some oh. fucked up shit. So what, they're all starving, but one of them's got a fucking cell phone? Uh, you oh my god. But that's forever, and there's been some, some blowback. Yeah. Supposed to be. Nine and a half? Me? Oh my god, they're, they're, pro they're protesting me. As they should. <laughs> Better do. Oh, yeah, he's pissed about Becca. I don't mean. I don't mean. I think he's just attacking this random guy because he's just pissed. Oh. Damn, Butcher ate that fucking bottle to the back of his head. Bro. Bro, does he just want to be like beat up or some shit? Like, he's just taking all those punches. Like, it's not even a. It didn't even look like he was really hurting him. Turns out it's Stormfront. Mm hmm. Changed your name. They've been moving you around like a fucking Catholic priest. Like a fucking Catholic priest. I just got that. Uh, how is she? Uh, Argentina, maybe. Early retirement. Yeah, I guess there's no point for him anymore because it's all for Becca and now it's gone. Goodbye, Huey. 
connect. Hello? Damn, it's over just like that? No, he's coming back, bro. He's coming back. He was doing it all for Becca. Then when he found out she was alive, that was all he wanted. But it's like, he found her. That's probably, you know, it's like the worst thing, the worst possible thing happened. And so it's like, well, he's, guess he's he has nothing left to chase. So he just gave up and retired. He was nice. Yeah. And he, he's defeated, bro. Oh no, Mother Milk's no, he knows it's serious. Tell me everything he said. Yeah, he knows it's serious. It's totally out of character for him to act like that. Oh my god, that fucking jump got or not that fucking Jacob, bro. Scared the fuck out of me. Like you like her, okay? <laughs> I love six stan girl all day. Why is that? Because I know who you really are, bitch. Former seven member, the deep surprised everybody last week no. when he met. Who's mm -hmm. this? Yeah. My nephew. Oh, shit. Well, nice to see you. You were not fast enough. I ain't <gasps> seeing him. And where's me boy? Wow. Oh, it's the dog. I was about to say, what do you, what does he mean by me boy? It's a kid, but no, he's talking about the dog. It's about you, Mika Funu. Swear to God, bro, this dog fucking dies. I'm gonna be so pissed. So this is what it all comes to, eh? Yep, so everyone goes to retire. Oh, fuck was any of it for? This butcher's about to regret retiring. He's about to be, nah, this ain't for me. I got some left in the tank still. No, Great. I did yeah. a little bit of a rewrite, and <laughs> I think the dialogue was a little, you know, A-Train. I want to read that. Say any of this shit. Right. I want to read that. Big farewell speech. <laughs> yeah, because he's he's, le he's leaving the seven. No, he he got booted, and I guess they're doing this, his goodbye, you know? He doesn't want to leave. Is A-Train really leaving the seven? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're just going to go ahead and do the scene as scripted. But thank wow. you for putting on... Put it in the scene. All right, good stuff. Rubbing up. That is way above my pay grade. Bring that up with Ashley, right? Damn. Yeah. He's not dealing with this. Bro, being on a movie set must be fucking cutthroat. Like, that would be a cool job. That'd be like a dream job until I feel like you're actually on it and you're like, fuck this, fuck everyone here. If it's like just super cutthroat, you know? But if everyone's cool and everyone gets along, then I'm sure it's hella fun. Show a picture of kids or some shit. Bro, she'll fucking kill you. Oh, he knew immediately. He said she ain't right in the head. Oh, oh. Oh my god. Okay, that's probably the most brutal thing I've seen in this show so far. Damn, she's eating those bullets. Bro, she ripped that dude's fucking face off. Ah. Oh, she shoved that gun in that bull's face. Oi, Billy. Oi. Oh, shit. <laughs> we found you, bitch. Mother Smoke knew exactly where to go. Oh, well, we're calling your bluff for right now. Ron, so. Okay. Brilliant as ever. Time to go. Good intuition, Mother Smoke. We came because we're worried. Your cunt sense tingling, is it? <laughs> Becca? What's oh, he talking shit. about? Oh shit. Lots of thanks. Time to piss off. I just wanna tell him. Friend. What? <laughs> it's fuck pink. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's all funny. Oh what the f oh it's Noor. It's Noor. That's right, yeah. Noor Noor saw him hop the border, hop the fence in the security cams. Damn, he's making that obvious he's there. She didn't want out. Yeah. His aunt's gonna die, bro. I'm sorry, Judy, I shouldn't And the dog might die, I swear to God. Maybe we can make a run for it. No. Uh, he moves faster than a car. We'll have to do it with an audience. Oh, he'll have to. Okay, no, he'll have to do it with an audience. I thought he said he'll want to do it. Okay, that makes more sense. He has to do it with the audience. I heard him wrong. <laughs> Remember the meltdown? Oh. Oh no! Stormfront, don't talk to my fucking mom. What? Stormfront knows what she's doing though. Do a brush in the mirror. I like this one. I don't. Can you imagine how angry that person is? Just whoever they are. Does Stormfront know? 
It was her? I'd be grateful to have a mom like Donna. Oh, that's a threat. That's a threat. Okay, Stormfront knows it was Starlight who did it. And that was a threat right there. Like, I'm gonna kill your fucking mom. Yeah, you know what? I just feel like lesbian is a bit of an easier sell, but more cut and dry. Now, I feel like Maeve just wanted to go about her life with this. And they're trying to fully exploit it and monetize it. And she's just, she's like, look, I just want to, I just want to live my life. Like, I don't want to do all this extra shit for, just because she's bi, you know? You're not going to say anything. Well, Maeve probably feels, th Maeve feels threatened by Homelander. So like, Maeve is being forced to kind of do this. And go stay with my sister. No, you can't do that. Why? He'll find you. He'll get you. I can't protect you if you leave. True. We're gonna take that motherfucker down. Yes. Yes. All right. Queen Maeve. Top three favorite character. Okay. I actually, I do really like her. What's going on? That uh, ninja comes here for me, isn't he? Yeah, don't wanna put your aunt Huey and Mother's Milk in danger and the dog. Expecting a happy ending, were we? Damn, butcher's ready to just go out. It ain't that kind of massage parlor. <laughs> <laughs> I could use a little lie down. Yeah, butcher's ready to just give up and die. Am I supposed to be impressed by this blaze of glory jerk off shit? <laughs> and the thing that kills me is that your wife is alive. She just doesn't want you. That's all. Dude, that hurts more. Come on, what do, what do any of us have besides? Each other. Um, You're so scared of being alone. I ain't interested. Okay, Butcher. You're too scared to be alone. You're ready to go out here and die. Then live alone for the rest of your life. So I think you're more afraid of being alone than he is. Don't make me move ya. <sighs> you can't move me. Good luck with me. Yeah, exactly. I feel like Mother's Milk would give him the work. I don't know who'd win that fight, if I'm being honest. Can I spice tea? Oh shit. Banians Damn. have her doing it. I'm just a girl getting 10%. Wow. Damn. Come with me, mon girl. Oh. <laughs> Stop trying to help me. Fuck you. Damn. Go be a monster. I mean, dude, Frenchie just has the most pure intentions, you know, but you just need to give her space. He's trying to save her from going down a path, turning to the dark side, but it's like, fuck. What the fuck is this? But thanks to the Church of the Collective, oh my god, I know. So join us at the Church of the Collective and be the person you- He, he sold out completely, bro. He sold out. Hey, James, I'm like, what the fuck? It's a bunch of bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. That place used to be pure. And then they just started letting all kinds of people in, you know? Oh my god. I don't know. So it was pure back when it was fucking so racist. You fuck you. Well, yeah, Adrian, you know. get presser right now. Presser. Quality and others are garbage. Bitch, you did not just say that. Oh my god, fuck it. You have a problem? Of course not. Why would you say that? Can I have a word? Oh Please. My god. I hope. Ah, dude. I fucking hate that bitch. I hate this bitch so much. Let me just talk to Homelander. We both know that's not a good idea. Yeah, it's not. Doesn't matter who I am, I'm avoiding Homelander at all costs. By shooting up Compound V and giving yourself a fucking heart attack in the fucking process. <sighs> you know, the truth is, I'm running my whole. Yeah, he did it. The sunset on Atrium. <laughs> it's been a good run. Cut! The fucking explosion behind him. <laughs> uh, it's not even, a, it's a stunt double. No, I'm gonna go ahead and move on. All right, check it, moving uh, on! Atrium's done, bro. How can I stay quiet and still look my- Who is this girl? Dixie D'Amelio? Up oh, in Compound V! Yes! Yes! Fuck yeah, preach it, Dixie. Oh shit, Homelander's here, oh shit. Oh god, oh god. He's not gonna kill her in front of everyone. Congresswoman Newman, everybody. Isn't she great? Congresswoman Newman. 
fun. It's not what we're here for, is and it? He's not, so just start by saying he's not supposed to do this. Ashley Sweekin. Everyone get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. Fuck you. Get <laughs> Wait, this happened no. before? How many times? Oh shit. You just expose yourself. Expose yourself. Comes at a price. You don't speak for us. Yeah. Fuck you. you don't speak for us. Fuck yeah. Oh, oh! Oh, oh, no, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way. This is no, it's what he wants to do. I'm not falling for it. No way, he just murdered all those people. No way. It's gonna cut, and it's gonna be him right before he did it. Yeah, okay, I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. No shot he's gonna do that. It's what he wanted to do, though. Love you guys! Oh, Ashley's fucking shaking in her boots. Oh, her hair's coming out. Oh, that's how stressed out she is. Dude, honestly... I would never want Ashley's job. Fuck that. That shit's so stressful. It's time. Right, lad. To the taffy room. To the taffy room? What? Some British shit? An affordable alternative to privatized healthcare. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's Butcher's family. What do you expect? Calm down. Let's not hurt your heart. Yeah, yeah now he's regretting doing that. <laughs> he's desperate to win over the public. And he, he for sure, he lost the public when that video got leaked. And especially after that, too. Think of it like that. Right. What the fuck? What, what the hell? A ward? What, are we in a psych ward? Who is she talking to? Is someone in a psych ward? Come in! Oh, no. Is he going to go to her for, like, advice on how to win over the public? <laughs> Where did you get all this? Wow. Oh, and you know it's working. Mm. Okay. So I guess she made him a bunch of memes to help fix his public image. Bro, I don't know if they can take Nor. I, I don't know. I'm not confident in them. Kind of looks like Nor's just gonna wait it out too. Billy wouldn't want me to say. Fuck Billy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, a little brother. Skinny, nervous little bugger, like you. <laughs> Thanks. It breaks Lenny's nose. Oh, oh Billy goes to work oh. on Lenny. Is he dead now? Way of making Billy not be... On a warpath? I think Billy needs someone like that, you know? I mean, it could be Huey, but he's not there yet. I feel like Butcher kind of resents Huey because he's like, no, you're not Lenny. You'll never be him, you know? Because that standard's already been set. Oh, God rest his soul. Oh, he's dead. Yeah. What happened? Oh shit. He's here. Mm. <laughs> Shut the fuck up! Seen the vent? Oh, um, god damn it. Smart, yeah. Butcher? Get him out of here. Uh, no, Butcher! Uh, oh shit, all the traps didn't, didn't work. Didn't do Dude, Norris just fucking invincible, I swear to god. He's taking so much damage. Oh, fuck. He's going to get out of here! Oh, no, 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 no. I'm the one you want. Oh. Come here! Not the dog, not the dog, please, please, please. Do not, no, come on. Hey, you can kiss your fucking career, good boy. Okay. My wife's son. Yep. Homelander's son. Yep. And it's a Ronan Farrow's inbox. Fuck yeah. I don't, I don't know if he has photos, but. There's nothing but a filthy fucking rapist. Yep. With a lot of trouble to keep out of the secret. Well, what if Nora just kills all of them right here? Then they can't leak it. Yeah. <laughs> Bro.
It's his fucking fault. Oh. Oh, shit. It's Edgar. Oh, there's a camera on him. How can I be sure you actually have the proof? Yeah. Uh, okay. Got yourself a deal. Want a shake on it? <laughs> <coughs> Damn. Okay. I don't. I don't know if Butch actually has the proof or not. I don't remember him taking any photos or anything. Of hey man, you alright? I'm okay. Ah, oh, thank God. Dude, he's like stabbed like right in the heart. Do you really have those pictures? Yeah. Of course I do. I don't know. It might be Kevin. I don't remember him ever doing it, but oh, he was smiling right there because uh Butcher. He just saved. He saved <laughs> Huey's life. He saved everyone else's. You know, he saved us all. He does care. Do you want to check this out? Oh, fuck no. <laughs> Tell everyone that you're not a complete piece of shit. He has that. I could be that person no. for you. I guess I got what, more. What, you think I'm a piece of shit? Fuck yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looks better if it's me versus someone random. About personal shit. Yeah. What were you trying to lie to me? About compound V, okay? Good cover, Starlight, good. That is a performance. Oh, she knows she's Gavin. Stormfront's like, why are you really here? I know you leaked it. Oh, yeah. You leaked it to MSNBC. I don't know what you're talking about, fam. World will feel when I tell them that you used to be Liberty. Yeah. Poison flower, huh? Going against your own people? I mean, fucking white people? Starlight. Wow. Superhero. Wow. Don't be racist. Shut the fuck off, Stormfront. To me. What the hell does that mean? Just gonna use her. Oh no. Does Homelander know she leaked it though? She had a, she had a tell him? Just between us girls, right, Starlight? Yeah. Yeah. Can't wait to shoot our scene together. Yeah, me too. Five ports. Okay, side note. Mm -hmm. That's a. This is a nice fucking trailer, dude. It has a fucking island in it. In the kitchen. In the kitchen. That, you know, upstairs to the bedroom. That's fucking nice. Well, what are you ever gonna do to repay me? <sighs> Bro, she has Homelander like this now. This is up five points. Fixes public image. I almost threw in the towel. Like the bleeding. I will get your mum back. I swear to God, I'll get your mum back. Fuck yeah, that's what I want to hear. That's what I want to hear. Can't give up on the dog. I almost forgot. I got you something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Homelander toy. Fuck it. Is <laughs> <laughs> that dream on? I guess MM's good after being stabbed. Whoa, whoa, what the fuck? What the? F no. Oh my. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Dude, they're. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, they both. They like it rough, I guess. Oh. Don't be a pussy. Laser my fucking tits. Oh my god. Oh god, fucking hurts. Don't stop. <laughs> Bro, it's like when a, like when a girl tells you to slap her, you're like, dude, no, I'm not slapping you. And then you do it super softly, you know? Uh, it's like that. But only when she tells you, only when she tells you. Let me make that clear. <sighs> oh my God. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they would be flying and doing it. All right, well, okay, okay. That was a fucking ending right there. I mean, it makes sense. They're both perfectly toxic for each other. <sighs> okay, whatever, okay, what? okay. Okay, so that was The Boys Season 2, Episode 5. Oh my, okay, I'll, I'll start with Butcher and all of them. Okay, so, okay, so after learning about Lenny, which is Butcher's little brother who passed away, you know, obviously Butcher cared about him, like, Butcher would literally beat the shit out of a fourth grader after this fourth grader beat up Lenny. And, you know, no one can pull him off except for Lenny. As soon as Lenny got in the way, he just stopped. He stopped. And he's like, okay, I'm done. You know, so he obviously cares and really respects Lenny to stop doing that. And I think he kind of resents Huey 
a little bit because he sees Huey as Lenny, but he's like, no, no one can replace Lenny. No one can be what Le Lenny meant to me, you know? he do Yeah, he doesn't want to replace Lenny in his head if he accepts Huey in the same way because Lenny just probably, Lenny just meant so much to him, so. But at the end right there, when Nor was about to kill Huey, Butcher, he did it, he, you know, he pulled the, he pulled his best card out right there. He's, you know, saying, look, if you kill him, I will expose Vod. But, okay, he had a good point, you know, but at the same time, what, okay, what would they do if Nor just killed all three of them? Like, killed everyone in the house right there. Then what are they going to do? I guess, okay, and Edgar, oh, he called him after, after Butcher said that. He's like, uh, are you, are you bluffing, you know? I guess Edgar probably assumed that, okay, these pictures and proof and evidence are probably with somebody else too that's not in this room. So if we kill them right now, someone else will just leak them who has access to them. So, okay. I'm guessing that's the way he's going off of right there. But it shows you that Butcher does care about them. He cares about them enough to save their life right there. You know, and I, Butcher's motivation it's back it's back it only took an episode for it to get back he's like you know what? i'm not giving up on becca just yet we still got a journey to go but we'll get there you know like what he said to the dog so okay i love to see it and huey smiled a lot. huey had a fat grin on his face because it just it proved to him that no butcher does care about you guys so okay love to see it love to see it honestly and like i really love mm too i don't really okay i don't really have like a favorite character order like i have my favorite characters but there's no like specific order to put them in like i i can't think of like a good order because i just i love them all a lot so mm is definitely up there he feels like the heart and soul of this team right now like he's the one keeping it together he's the glue he's the mold you know he, he's pretty much the middleman for huey and butcher because like when huey and butcher try and talk to each other it doesn't really work out but mm he gets butcher enough and he sympathizes with huey enough to where he can be that middleman try get the butcher what he was trying to tell him and make sure he gets through to butcher so i love to see it and then like homelander's like mass murder scene like okay for a second i was like i was like dude no way like no he didn't actually just do this but then on the other hand, I, I paused for a second when I was watching because I was like, dude, honestly, he might be doing this right now. He might be doing this. Like, he's so unstable. It's like, he might be doing this. But then it's like, no, he's not that. He's not that dumb to do that and ruin, completely ruin his public image, you know? So I knew it, it had to be like a cut to where it's just like, it's just in his head. Because like, honestly, that's what Homelander cares about the most is like his public image. Like, he, he just wants to be a fucking god to everyone. So like... I don't think he's dumb enough to just do that and kill all these innocent people in front of him. If he truly cares about being, you know, basically worshipped, he wouldn't do that because that would just ruin it forever. So, dude, it, it fucking pisses me off. Just like how openly racist Stormfront is. Like, it, I fucking hate this bitch, dude. Like, like when she was telling A-Train back when the church was pure, like I immediately knew, I immediately knew she was talking about that. It's like, dog. Like, what, is her goal just to have, like, a fucking pure society and, like, her eyes, what she deems as pure? Like, and, like, okay, and I feel bad for Maeve because, like, dude, her personal life, she wanted to keep that just to herself. She didn't want it to be public because she knew probably, she probably knew what Bob was going to do about it and just try and monetize the fuck out of it and just market the fuck out of it, too. And then, so, as soon as Homelander found out, she knew this was going to happen. And he's literally, like, he's, like threatening elena against her so she has to go along with this and like homelander's doing it to fuck with her and like basically control her and like she just wants to be happy with elena like that's all she wants and then stormfront knows that starlight leaked everything about va and stuff and okay she made an interesting comment as homeland before homelander walked in like and she's like no i'll need you later like some she said i don't forget exactly what she said but she was like i'll need you later or some shit and then homelander came in but yeah so she's probably just gonna blackmail starlight or something and you know use her for some shit you know and like i wanted homelander to kill this bitch because i really hope they were i like they had a feud but i guess it's fucking resolved like i can't wait till stormfront dies i, I know she's gonna die i know she's gonna die eventually it's gonna feel so satisfying when she dies it's gonna be the most satisfying death I've, I've probably have ever seen in a TV show. I just, I know it's coming. I know it's coming. But yeah, that was The Boys Season 2, Episode 5. Comment down below what you thought about this episode, down below in the comments. And if you liked the video, like the video. And thanks for watching.